A nation's culture resides in the hearts and in the soul of its people. Our most valuable and most instructive materials in the history of man are treasured up in India. Indian culture certainly gives the Indian mind, including the mind of the Indian scientist, the ability to think out of the box. The true India resides in its villages. Indian culture is essentially much more of a we culture. It's a communal culture where you do what's best for the community, you procreate. Our most valuable and most instructive materials in the history of man are treasured up in India. Movie are a big part of our Indian culture. Man's heart away from nature becomes hard. Knowledge was inherent in all things. The world was a library. The purification required is not of untouchables but of the so-called superior caste. Sing your death song and die like a hero going home. The old Lakota was wise. He knew that a man's heart away from nature becomes hard. India has two million gods and worships them all. In religion all other countries are paupers. India is the only millionaire. India is a country in which every great religion finds a home. If India is not secular, then India is not India at all. You can take the Indian out of the family, but you cannot take the family out of the Indian. There has been no more revolutionary contribution than the one which the Hindus made when they invented zero. The concept of zero is attributed to the Hindus. The Hindus were also the first to use zero in the way it is used today. We owe a lot to the Indians, who taught us how to count, without which no worthwhile scientific discovery could have been made. When I read the Bhagavad Gita and reflect about how God created this universe everything else seems so superfluous. Anything which you do to someone comes back to you. That is the karma principle, very simple. India may be a land of over 100 problems, but it is also a place for a billion solutions. India has an unbroken tradition of non-violence from times immemorial.